Thanks for checking out this episode of Brutal Battle Beer Break. Today I'm doing another beer by The Brewery out of Placentia, California. This is one of their sours. It is the La Ronce, which is a sour blonde ale done aged with uh, boysenberries in oak barrels and is 6% alcohol by volume. As you can see, La Ronce. Um, I'm not too familiar with boysenberries, honestly, but I assume they're probably something pretty similar to like a blackberry. So I'm going to be looking for that type of flavor, but we'll see. Ooh. Well, I do know that boysenberries have a reddish hue to them, so this makes a lot of sense that it looks very red. Uh, a little purplish, maybe, just like the label. But, uh, yep, as you can see, there's some pretty big bubbles along the edges that are coming up. Um, decent head to it, but very nice color, very reddish, purplish, beautiful color. Ooh, so much tartness like right off the bat that you would assume from a sour blonde from the brewery because that's how they do it. Uh, there's a bit of a funky aspect to it, which is probably coming out of the kind of like oaky characteristics, but also just the sourness in general does that a lot. Mm, it's, it's very, very sour, um, and there's a difference between tartness and sour, in my opinion. I'll just move that for a second. Um, Tartness is a lot softer to me. Sour is very aggressive. There's a very aggressive sourness that just kind of goes up my nose. I'm getting more of the woody oak characteristics coming out of this as well. And it's very fruity as well. Um, kind of similar to like a blackberry smell like I was saying, I would assume. But let's give it a taste. Mm. Tingles on the tongue immediately. All the sourness pricking up your taste buds making your mouth water a little bit, kind of stinging the edges of your tongue with that sourness, leaving my tongue pretty dry. It's like a hit of lemony, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> woo, a little bit went down the windpipe. It's a hit of lemony sourness right up front, then I get that taste of the boysenberry, what I'm assuming is the boysenberry, because that's what it's done with. Like I said, not too experienced with boysenberries. Actually, I don't even know if I've ever had a boysenberry. But anyway, so then you're getting the flavor of the boysenberry, and it kind of ends with a little bit of that funky aspect and some of the um, oaky wood characteristic as well. Kind of round it out a little bit, make it a little less sour on the finish. Very crisp. Yeah, and what I like about the oak aging, and this happens with a lot of sours, is that you can get that extreme nice um, sourness right up front and then it tends to just round it out at the end and make it very soft on the finish which that's what's happening with this beer this is a nice beer uh, I expected to enjoy it <coughs> excuse me expectation met this is very nice not at all disappointed by the brewery once again so thank you very much the brewery La Ronce quite tasty if you can get a hold of it do so if not go find yourself another awesome beer to try and thank you very much